When it comes to managing diabetes, the choice between Apidra and Novorapid can be a difficult one. Both are fast-acting insulin analogs that have proven effective in helping diabetics control their blood sugar levels. But how do they compare? In this video, we will conduct a comprehensive analysis of Apidra and Novorapid, exploring their similarities, differences, and common applications in diabetes management. Understanding Diabetes and Insulin Before we dive into the specifics of Apidra and Novorapid, it's important to have a basic understanding of diabetes and how insulin works. Diabetes is a chronic condition characterized by high blood sugar levels due to the body's inability to effectively produce or use insulin. Insulin, a hormone produced by the pancreas, plays a crucial role in regulating blood sugar levels. It allows glucose to enter cells, where it is used for energy. In individuals with diabetes, the body either does not produce enough insulin, type 1 diabetes, or does not respond properly to the insulin it produces, type 2 diabetes. This imbalance leads to elevated blood sugar levels, which can have serious health consequences if left unmanaged. Insulin therapy is a common treatment approach for diabetes, helping to maintain blood sugar levels within a target range. Similarities between Apidra and Novorapid Apidra and Novorapid are both rapid-acting insulin analogs, meaning they work quickly to lower blood sugar levels after a meal. They are designed to mimic the effects of natural insulin and have a similar mechanism of action. Both Apidra and Novorapid are available as injectable solutions and are typically administered subcutaneously using an insulin pen or syringe. One of the key similarities between Apidra and Novorapid is their ability to effectively control postprandial glucose spikes. After a meal, blood sugar levels tend to rise, and these rapid-acting insulin analogs can help bring them back down to a normal range. This makes them particularly useful for individuals with diabetes who struggle to regulate their blood sugar levels after eating. Another similarity between Apidra and Novorapid is their dosing flexibility. Both insulin analogs can be adjusted based on individual needs, allowing for personalized insulin therapy. This flexibility is important as the insulin requirements can vary between individuals and can change throughout the day. Being able to fine-tune the dose of insulin helps individuals achieve better blood sugar control. Differences between Apidra and Novorapid While Apidra and Novorapid share many similarities, there are also some important differences to consider when choosing between the two. One notable difference is the onset, peak, and duration of action of each insulin analog. Apidra has a slightly faster onset and shorter duration of action compared to Novorapid. This means that Apidra starts working more quickly after injection but may not last as long as Novorapid. The difference in onset and duration of action may be advantageous for individuals who need precise control over their insulin levels. For example, someone who needs to rapidly lower their blood sugar levels after a meal may benefit from the faster onset of Apidra. On the other hand, individuals who require a longer duration of action may find Novorapid more suitable. Onset, Peak, and Duration of Action to understand the differences in onset, peak, and duration of action between Apidra and Novorapid, let's take a closer look at each insulin analog individually. Apidra. Apidra has a rapid onset of action, typically starting to work within 10-20 minutes after injection. It reaches its peak effect within 1-2 hours and has a duration of action of around 3-5 hours. This rapid onset and shorter duration make Apidra a good option for managing postprandial glucose spikes and for individuals who need precise control over their insulin levels. Novorapid Novorapid also has a rapid onset of action, starting to work within 10-20 minutes after injection. It reaches its peak effect within 1-3 hours and has a duration of action of around 3-5 hours. While the onset and duration of action are similar to Apidra, Novorapid may have a slightly longer duration of action in some individuals. Injection techniques and dosing considerations. Proper injection technique and dosing considerations are essential for effective insulin therapy. Both Apidra and Novorapid can be self-administered using an insulin pen or syringe. It is important to follow the instructions provided by your healthcare provider and to rotate injection sites to prevent lipohypertrophy, a condition characterized by the buildup of fatty tissue at injection sites. When it comes to dosing, the flexibility of both Apidra and Novorapid allows for personalized insulin therapy. The dose of insulin required may vary depending on factors such as individual insulin sensitivity, carbohydrate intake, activity level, and blood sugar monitoring. Regular blood sugar monitoring and close collaboration with a healthcare provider are crucial for determining the appropriate dose of insulin. 
Common Applications in Diabetes Management Both Apidra and Novorapid are commonly used for managing diabetes, particularly in individuals who require rapid-acting insulin to control postprandial glucose spikes. They can be used in combination with long-acting insulins or other oral glucose-lowering medications to achieve optimal blood sugar control throughout the day. In addition to their use after meals, Apidra and Novorapid can also be used in specific situations such as correcting high blood sugar levels, hyperglycemia, or managing blood sugar levels during illness or stress. It is important to work closely with a healthcare provider to develop an individualized diabetes management plan that includes the appropriate use of these insulin analogs. Side effects and safety profile. Like any medication, Apidra and Novorapid can have potential side effects. Common side effects include injection site reactions, redness, swelling, or itching, hypoglycemia, low blood sugar, and hypersensitivity reactions. It is essential to be aware of these potential side effects and to report any concerns to your healthcare provider. Hypoglycemia is a significant concern with insulin therapy. It can occur if the dose of insulin is too high or if there is a mismatch between the dose of insulin and the amount of food consumed. Symptoms of hypoglycemia include sweating, dizziness, confusion, shakiness, and hunger. It is important to be prepared for hypoglycemia by carrying a source of fast-acting glucose, such as glucose tablets or gel. Cost and accessibility. Cost and accessibility are important considerations when choosing between Apidra and Novorapid. The availability and cost of insulin can vary by country and healthcare system. In some cases, insurance coverage may dictate which insulin analog is more affordable. It is important to check with your insurance provider or healthcare system to determine the cost and accessibility of Apidra and Novorapid. In recent years, there has been an increased focus on improving the affordability and accessibility of insulin. Various initiatives and advocacy efforts aim to reduce the financial burden associated with insulin therapy, particularly for individuals who do not have adequate insurance coverage. It is important to stay informed about these initiatives and resources that may help make insulin more accessible. Conclusion and choosing the right insulin for you. In conclusion, Apidra and Novorapid are both rapid-acting insulin analogs that can be effective in helping individuals with diabetes manage their blood sugar levels. They share similarities in their mechanism of action, dosing flexibility, and common applications in diabetes management. However, they also have some differences in their onset, peak, and duration of action, which may influence the choice between the two. Choosing the right insulin for you is a decision that should be made in consultation with your healthcare provider. Factors to consider include your individual insulin requirements, lifestyle factors, cost, and accessibility. By discussing your specific needs and goals with your healthcare provider, you can determine whether Apidra or Novorapid is the best fit for your diabetes management plan. Remember, effective diabetes management goes beyond insulin therapy. It involves a holistic approach that includes healthy eating, regular physical activity, blood sugar monitoring, and ongoing support from healthcare professionals. With the right tools and support, you can successfully manage your diabetes and lead a fulfilling life.